Hello, I'm very glad to present you our new tool called Smart Hangers. Smart Hangers is a very useful tool for MEP engineers to finish their design with hanging pipes, ducts, conduits, cable trays on hangers. They can be hanged vertically or horizontally, connecting them to walls, structural framing, planes, and so on. Smart Hangers comes with few parametric sample families, which you can explore and make your own ones. There is also some tips and explanation of how to do that in e-help that is included with software. Here I have a project with ducts, so I'll try to show you how easy hangers are inserted to project. The workflow is select a duct or an array of ducts, like so. Press the button of what you want to do with the duct. Let's say I want to insert horizontal duct hangers. We will select the hanger we want to insert. As you can see, this comes with software. I want to connect hangers to the structural framing that goes above the ducts. So I select the web connection with a single rod hanger and I'll add it to my project. Now um, I will select a rule. I want to array my hangers on the uh, on the duct I will select the fixed number distribution I don't have to worry about the layout value that is written over here as you can see the explanation of what these values mean is shown in a pop-up pop box box that's that shows when you hover uh, over the name of the parameter. So, my connection type is vertical. Connection direction is top. I will connect to structural framing. So, I will choose the family I want to connect it to. So, I will ch select, as I know, my structural framing is this family and I will insert hangers to the model. As we can see the hangers were inserted correctly. We can check If everything's all right, it is. It automatically detects where the structural framing is and puts the hangers in the, pos the right position and where they should be. And it also cuts holes in structural framing, as you can see. Hangers are automatically generated by duct diameter and placed correctly to the places that should be. So I will show you again. Let's say try the different connection, the support connection of the pipe. So I will select a different function like this one, insert horizontal duct supports. I will press it. And now I will select the, the different, it shows the different uh, families I can work with. I will work with this one.
and I'll distribute it by the by the fixed number and I wanted to connect it to, to wall so it automatically just let it automatically let me do that and I will insert them to model as we can see five elements were inserted and they automatically connected to the wall as you can see now let's connect a vertical duct to a wall with a hanger so I'll select vertical duct I'll press insert vertical duct support now I can choose the same hanger uh, as I did previously and I'll leave it at that it should insert two hangers to my model and it did it alright uh, all let's check it as you can see they're inserted but I need it I need them to be connected to a wall so I will select both of them and what I need to do is just go to this menu and press attach hangers supports to wall select a wall that you want the hangers to be attached and that's it as you can see it automatically detect, detected the lens and the position of the wall and connected the hangers to it can you see how easy it is incredible smart hangers completes the MEP design in a way that no tools does in Revit contact us on www.aga cad.com find our number or email and ask for a trial now. AJ CAD, a lean thinking company.